Hello friends, my name is Taufik and you are watching my channel Graphics Den. So in this video, I am going to tell you how we can change the corners in Adobe InDesign. Along with that, how we can use different types of corner options in InDesign. So let's get started. So first I will create a rectangle. I will apply a color. And for now, I will turn off the outline. Now we can do this by two ways. First is simply click on the rectangle and in this option bar or control panel we can see the option over here so we have the value of the corners but firstly we need to choose the type so I will choose rounded and I will change the value so as you can see all the corners are getting rounded so from here we can change the value and from here we can select different types of corner options like this bevel fancy and some other and if we choose none then it will show it will show a normal rectangle and if you want to see more options we can simply press alt or option and left click so we will get corner options and from here we can change the corners individually like this firstly I will link them together I will click none now if I if I want to change the corners individually separately so I will simply turn this off and let's say I want this one as inverse rounded so this will become inverse rounded so we can change the corners individually by using this option simply press alt or option and left click so we will get this option and keep the preview on and this is the one way we can do it and the other way I will choose none from here and the other way is we can see this option I will zoom it a little bit you can see this option yellow point so simply click on this yellow point and drag so we will get this corner options and what if you want to use different types so simply press alt or option and left click so we will get different types alt press and hold alt and left click so we will get different options like this again press and hold alt and left click so this is how we can change corners in InDesign so this is one method and this is the other method so using these two methods we can simply change the corner options and use different types in corner options like this and if you want to change the corners individually you can simply click alter option and left click and simply turn this option off so we can change it separately like this so uh, that's it for this video i hope hope you find this video useful if you do please give this video a like and subscribe to my channel i will see you in the next video until then bye bye and cheers